Boom. What is up? This is Mick with Fresh and Fleet, and I'm back here. Local thrift. Let's hit it up. Good morning. In here, look at this jacket. The nautical jacket. Look at this patchwork. Tag's gone. Probably wanting like $15 for this thing. Let's see what they have in the shoes over here. Some uh, hyper dunks. So, let's see. Some Adidas. Get some guest kicks. 20 bucks. They tax heavy in here though, I know that. Let's see. Hmm, I don't see anything yummy in here though. Too bad, but look at my yummy shoes. That's what I'm talking about. Oh yeah. Hey, check these out. This is like the Pumas, but they're like GV special. Look at the Gucci stuff right there. I could totally relate. So check this out, I did find this. It is a Hunger Games training shirt. Now I don't know if this is a some kind of a part of the movie or what, but this is pretty cool. That's what I like about this thrift store. They get like movie props sometimes, movie uh, outfits. Cause you can see the tags, they usually have names on them. Look at this. So this is kind of like Tommy Hilfiger, yummy stuff they got in the kids section. Look at this, mini flag, you already know. You got the red. Check out this old school Stussy shirt right here. Very nice little world depiction. Size large, 99 cents. Size large. Look at that. Oh, you already know that pho, that I pho. I want some pho. So check this out, man, for a dollar ninety-nine home AFM. Look at this. Ford, Loran, Home Farm, Margiela, St. Laurent, Lagerfield, Owens, McQueen, and Wang. So we got that Voltron for 99 cents, as well as that Mickey Mouse, that Legend, 299. So check this out, man. Look at these. Tagachi. Like, full outfits, man. These are like stylish as hell. Gotta get this purple, though. That dragon. Got the H&M, easy iron on. Get some more of that Tommy. Modern. Look at all this. They got all that fresh Tommy for the little kids, man. $6.99. Look. This is where all of them are. So I always look in the bags over here, but uh, I've never found anything. I found like a Gucci tennis racket holder from like the 70s, and then they pulled it back there and they sold it for like 30 after $13.99. Uh, hmm. I don't know what this is. I don't know. I don't see too much. See Hello Kitty backpack. What the hell was that? Oh. Get the bloomies. <laughs> Marinello, yo. Uh. Do we gotta get this? You already know. <laughs> yes. So that's what's up. So I'm taking off right now. Um, crazy enough, I left my phone in the car. So I like to take like little pictures sometimes, maybe doing those snap, Instagram snaps, or whatever. But I didn't get to. Did pick it up. It was a dollar forty-nine. Which again, I always come here and the price is always like cheaper than what it's listed. I think it has to do with. The I don't think there's a sale, so I don't know. So I'm taking off right now. Check out the bag. You already know. Shivanchi. I said it right this time. Oh yeah, let's go. So we are in here. That's what's up. Let's check out the shoes right away. You do got the Air Force Ones, the Square, as well as some Ralph Lauren kicks right here. $7.99. $9.99. These are always good. Look at these. Yellow wing's a little heavy on those, uh, cheese. $9.99. So I don't know what these are, but I think these are the rideable ones. <laughs> this one says I love pink cheap, and then <laughs> pink and cheap, and this one's I love telly. I don't know if you're talking about the tubbies, but always good finding these, the shell toes, man. Ten and a half my size also. How much they want from No price, you can just imagine. Last but not least, I did see these, uh, like the Carolina colorway. 
ones right here. Um, price has been ripped off. I always find them like this, and they're always yellowed out here, but that can always be taken care of, but these are just too small for me to take it serious, 5.5Y, but they're nice anyway. They can all be, this all can be taken care of. Not even too bad. And I found this, um, rock egg, I don't know. So it's this little puppy. Look at these. These are nice. Go check out this. I did find this uh, shoulder holster right here. That's pretty nice. So check this out. I got the polo jeans. Nice patchwork right here. Size large. I believe it's a kid's or a women's. And that is just a nice patchwork right there. Yeah, mister. Check out the shirt. The Chewbacca or the Bigfoot on the skateboard. It's the soup. You know, like... Halloween's coming up. I think I want to be this borracho. Look at the DW drum set. Uh, DW drum wear, actually, medium. Too bad it's not extra large. My dad would love this stuff. Ramen party all day. Nice hundred shirt. Hundreds is huge. Tag's been ripped out. So I'm taking off. Um, I didn't find too much. Found a few pieces in there, but nothing very exciting. So I'm taking off right now. Let's go. Boom. Yeah, Mr. Someone spilled. I don't even know what that is. It's crazy. It's popping off in here. I don't know what's going on. Might be some sale. We got the bikes. Oh, yeah. Shout out to Nazca Lines over here in Peru. Get the Tom Hilfiger V-neck sweater right here. And like I said, do not get caught. Size medium right there. Bigger rider. Oh, Stampede Polo. Let's see, size medium, $8.99, man. It's a nice white. Look at this. Let me check this out. Get that Polo Bar of Florence, $6.99. Look at that. <laughs> nice print. Dude, look at this. This Saint Laurent t shirt, size medium, $1.99. Definite cop. Look at this. This is dope right here. This Iverson The Answer T-shirt limited edition for 99 cents. I believe it's an XL. Dude, bow down to the crossover master. Do check this out. You sent another one, but this one is a. It's a little bit cracking. Well, no, not that cracking. It's the material, but it's a V-neck. Look at this. Dollar 99 extra large. So they're making an announcement right now that the children, someone's children, like got went missing, and then so we'll keep watch over your children. Everything's loud. But check this out. I did find this. Uh, I believe it's Gianfranco Ferre Beachwear T. Uh, it's a 52, so that means like a size large uh, for dollar 99. So I'm leaving right now. I didn't think it was gonna be that much of a deal, but it was pretty good of a deal. So I should have been paying like eight dollars, and I got it for five bucks, five dollars and twenty-two cents. Got my goodies as always. Here we go. Boom. Okay, so we're at the wall right now. Let's go. Okay, so we're in, we're in that Goodwill. Let's go. Let's see what they got in those shoes. Let's see if they got any talent. So check this out, man. Look at these boots right here. You already see what they are. Polo sport boots. They're a size, um, size seven. Look at these. The polo sport on there. Pretty nice little find here, but $7.99. Size seven. Too crazy. I see it, I see it. Get that made in Italy, that Burberry. Get that Olaf, he's electronic. What does he do? I think in this condition, whatever he does, he's doing it right now. Oh yeah. So they got a few overalls here. Look at this one. I got that FUBU denim overall. This is awesome. Got that FUBU collection, 1992. They have, I believe this is a Gap one. Nope. This is Eagle Eagle Jeans. This is Gap. This is Big Mac. It's crazy, but look at this piece right here. Okay, look at this. It's a polo by Ralph Lauren, like white trench coat. Look at this thing, man. I gotta pull this out. Like, check this out. It's this polo right there. Gotta try this on. So check it out. Look at this thing. It's an all white. Polo duster. Oh my gosh. Look at this thing. It's trench coat. It's got polo all over this thing on the zippers, on every little zipper line. 
this little clasp right here is the internal buttons on every little zipper. It says Polo. They're wanting like 30 bucks for it, man. I don't know. Take a chance on it, maybe. It's so crazy. <laughs> so check out this piece, man. This looks like... It says real tree right there, but this looks like that Levi's print. Like even Supreme had a collab with them. Their bucket hats and their jacket. It looks like almost exactly like this. It's crazy. So check this out, man. Size small. Yeezus want to. Uh, I believe it's a reprint because of this, but you never know with this Gildan stuff. Huh. Oh, you already know, Dancing Zorba's. So honestly, because of the tag and everything, plus this, if you can see, it's like kind of a pixelated Yeezus on the top. I already can tell it's kind of like, um, you know, a rep, but the thing what's freaking me out is the material on this, because it feels so much different than a regular like t-shirt. That's what it is, I looked it up. It's not looking good. We got a Bryant jersey as well as a Howard jersey. The Adidas ones. So too crazy, man. I'm leaving there. I pulled the trigger on that $30 polo duster and all white. Uh, great condition, man, but 30 bucks. Man. That's how it goes. Let's go. All right, so we're doing it. Hanging out. What the? Let's check the talent again. Let's check the talent. Get the free runs. These are always nice. Size 10, though. 999. We do have the high top Janoskis for $14.99. Size 11. Dude, look at these. What the hell? They're the Nike Zooms. They want 14 and it looks like an Air Max 90. What the hell? Well, I did find this Tabasco, um, I did find this Tabasco um, hot sauce tie, which is really cool. They got the Calvin Klein duffel bag right here. Pretty nice. I don't see a tag, bro. Oh, it's right there. One fourteen ninety nine. Is that Nautica? Do they still have that polo sweater? Now you're running out straight out of Maryland. What does Maryland do? Crab cakes and football. Go check this out. They got that mustaches t shirt by the penguin here, you know. I don't know. I'm going over for the easy rider at the Cheech. Oh, oh, oh. I saw it from over there. Check this out. You got the polo jeans. No idea. They want $14.99. Look at this. I don't know, some kind of uh, it's like a bag. I know. You know what's cold and crispy outside and you want to get a hot cup of coffee? Just go with the nips, right? This is awesome. Peppermint schnapps. Look at this. He's drinking this much though. Check this out. I found this Kangol hat. Came on the new rack. I mean, I used to have one of these. I used to have one of these back uh, and it was like a tan one. Many of you guys remember this. Pop bottle science. Look at this. Classic. Look at all the sad sex boxes they have here. You guys got the brand new chaps, Ralph the Rent wool shorts, as well as the Tommy shorts here. Small flag. Polo shirt. I've never <laughs> actually seen or found a polo shirt. It's got the tags. This patch is really nice, the yacht club patch. It's actually a very nice shirt. It's the color. Color of the week is green. Could be a cop. So I'm taking it off. You know, it's one of those moments when you go to the thrift store and you don't find anything too substantial. You end up needing your wantings and wanting your needings. You know what I'm talking about. So I'm taking off right now. I'm gonna hit the last place. Let's go. Boom, okay, we're in here. It smells better in here. Let's go. Look at this Jansport backpack. Look at the material. Dude, what are the odds of this? Look, look there's another Kingle hat right here. I don't know if it's real. It's a Kingle design, I don't know. So size extra large, oh, 2XL, and then 229, it's a primitive shirt. Look at this Disneyland Resort, 55, tank top. It's 
so what do we have here? Hmm. Ralph Lauren Polo Sport. 629. So check this out. It's a uh, Ralph Lauren uh, 67 Crest logo. You can see it's Lauren by Ralph Lauren. It's right there. This is like, I think it's considered a woman's uh, clothing top. 229. And the gold and black. Looks really nice though. Now this is a dope shirt right here. I think it's a size large. Gorilla's tee. I got this shirt. It says shirts for all my friends. a size medium. Look at the print on it. It's crazy. Look at this. The Primitive on the Boulevard. Size large. Good for life. Large uh, Jordan tee. It's kind of messed up, but dude, that print is awesome, man. Aquas. So check out this Tommy Hilfiger piece right here. Size small. Look at it. All the golf clubs. Diamonds. As well as a Johnny Cupcake shirt. Again, both size small. I did find these Zara men pants right here, but um, they're extra large, 729 jogger style. But as you already know, fortunately, I had to leave that gorilla's piece. The only problem was it had like stains all over the armpits, and it's the kind of stains that when you try to wash it, it's gonna mess up the color of the shirt. So, too bad with that. So, I'm taking off. Here we go. Let's get in the recap. Let's go. So, first cop of the day, I did pick up this. I don't know, how do you say it really? It's like Home FM, you know, number 90. I see, I've seen this before because of what it says on the back. Because as you can see, it's Ford, Laurent, Margiela, St. Laurent, Lagerfield, Owens, McQueen, Wang, and that's pretty much, like I saw this, I saw this in like a high snobbity uh, clothing report or whatever, and you know, I picked it up, it was $1.99. Uh, small beginning cop of the day, it was pretty nice. On to that. After that, I did pick up a mini plethora of shirts. As you can see, this Saint Laurent right here, very nice shirt, size medium, uh, $1.99. That's one, I love the print on this one, man. Look at that, it's really yummy. Uh, this one is like a V-neck, says made in Italy. The tag's coming off on the top, this one. Uh, made in Italy, but the tag's still good. Honking horns out here, if you know what I mean. As you can see, wonderful print. Love this thing. I've seen this shirt before. Somebody else copped it uh, on an Instagram post or whatever, and this is great to find. Again, $1.99. says size medium. Now, I have no idea. <laughs> like I'm about it. I don't know. Um, that's what's going on over there. But um, this company is called, uh, I think it's uh, Gianfranco Ferre Beachwear. Uh, I've seen the shirts. The shirts are going pretty expensive, kind of like, you know, with like 80 bucks or whatever for a t shirt. So I had to pick this thing up. It says GF, it stands for Gianfranco. Um, Gianfranco, um, and it's a nice uh, nautical looking shirt, um, let's see how it goes with the shirt, it looks pretty crazy, but just had to pick it up, uh, a little high fashion kind of look. As well as that, I picked up a classic shirt that I, I said if I ever found one um, in great condition, I would have to pick it up, and it was, it's a little bit large, it's a size, um, I believe it's a size XL, um, but it's a limited edition uh, Reebok t-shirt. As you can see, look at that, the Iverson, the i3, the answer uh, in that nice metallic colorway. The only problem is right there. This is where it is, is that this letter is popped up, but I will be uh, reattaching that. Uh, other than that, the rest of it's so super nice. I mean, it's super clean for the age of it. And yeah, you got the i3 right there. On to the last piece of the day, which was crazy. Uh, the price was a little crazy, as you know. Um, this is this is the all white uh, polo, the all white polo by Ralph Lauren trench coat. I think I showed it to you guys pretty much. I'll show you this right there. But on the tag right there, on the, zip, on the zipper line, it does say polo. Uh, it says polo all over on this thing as well as I thought this was missing, but it was on the back. And each one of these has an RL in them, as well as the clasp here. Um, it just it's RL Polo all over the place. So every single little tag, every little clasp says Polo. As you can see, I paid 30 bucks for it. So hopefully in the long run, this will pay off because I, I do well with these Polo pieces when they're like this. It's funny, you would think uh, the the more, um, you know what? The more extravagant the print is, is usually the older it is. And as you can see, this has nothing barely on it, but it does have a lot of things going for it because of it is, it is a trench coat, which means uh, it goes for a, lo a lot more money than a usual jacket would. Now it's not old school, like it doesn't have the 93, it's not the stadium, but 
it's uh it is what it is and i had to pick it up um super nice it's super clean that's another thing it's white usually doesn't stay white with age it starts getting kind of the tint to it luckily for this this is like pretty clean there's no stains on it which i couldn't believe maybe taking once to a dry cleaners you know just prep it up and uh we'll see how it goes from there so I want to say thank you guys for watching again. It's another video, another installment to Fresh from the Flea Thrift Trip. And I want to thank you guys for watching because it means a lot to me uh, knowing that people are out there having fun, doing the same thing, making money, making friends, making connections. And remember, it's all about the thrift life. So I'm going to say what I always say. Hit that sub button because more videos are coming. This was Mick from Fresh from the Flea.